So let's do that. I'm going to go, okay, if I go to the bank feeds then, and I look at my transactions, here's the transaction. It didn't pick it up. It's not seeing it directly. So let's go into it. And the only way it would see it to match it is by, by dollar amount and possibly by date. So let's go into it and say, okay, I want to match this to an invoice. If I go into the match, then it's pulling up that payment. So now you can see it saying, okay, now I see the payment that we're matching to. So there's the suggested matches, one connected. So now I'm going to record this, which should record the, the, the deposit. So that next transaction. So I'm going to, it's actually going to do a transaction. So I'm going to save it. And so now it's recorded that. And if I go to my balance sheet and run it, I should have a checking account item within it for that, uh, for that deposit of the 420. Let's check it by dollar amount over here. There it is right there. So now it's recorded with a deposit form here and it made the deposit for it. So if I go into it, it made the deposit uh, form and it looks just like that deposit form that I was gonna, that I was showing you that we could have done on our side. All right, and then the other side decreased the clearing account. The other side decreased the clearing account and the payments to deposit and boom, uh, it's back down. So now it actually made a transaction.